Hello, my name is Jeff Carlson, and in this video, I will be providing you a step-by-step -step instructions as to how to load print drivers for your Conic Minolta BizHub copier printer. We will be discussing both the color copier printer as well as our black and white copier printers. First, we're going to start with our C550 color copier printer with the Fiery print controller. The first step in the process is to obtain the IP address of your copier printer. First, we're going to start with our C550 color copier printer installed with a Fiery print driver. The first step to install the or to identify the IP address is to touch the information button on your control panel. Next, touch the menu button. Then touch print pages. Then touch configuration. Now that you've touched the configuration button, a report page will print out with the IP address of your copier printer. Now we're standing at a BizHub 600 black and white copier printer with an Ampron print controller. To, to obtain the IP address, the first step is to touch the utility button. Next, You'll touch user settings, then printer settings, and then print reports, and then finally configuration page. Now that you've obtained the IP address from your Conic Minolta copier printer, the next step is to download the latest print drivers from the Conic Minolta website. To obtain the print drivers, the first thing you want to do is type in www.conicminolta. US. Once you're at our website, the first step is to select Office Systems, then select Driver Download. Once you're at Driver Download, the next step is to select the copier printer that you'll be downloading a driver for. As you can see, we've selected Color Products, this sub C550, drivers and Windows 2000 slash XP. Next, we're going to make sure we select a proper controller for our copier printer. In this case, we're going to select the IC409, which is a fiery print controller with a PostScript and PCL print driver. To download the file, we want to make sure that we have identified a folder to download this print driver to. Now that we've downloaded the new print driver, we want to add a new printer. The next step is to click the Start button, Settings, and then Printers and Faxes. Next, click on Add Printer, and when you, your wizard to add a printer pops up, click Next. Next, select Local Printer attached to this computer, and do not check Automatically Detect, and then click Next. Now, it's important to understand that if you're installing your print driver on an existing PC that has had the print driver on it before and it may have been deleted, you want to use the following port selection, click on the drop down box, and locate the IP address that you have associated with that copy of printer. Or, if it's a brand new PC that you're loading this print driver on for the first time, you want to create a new port. So select create new port, and then next. To create a new port, select your drop down box and select standard IP port and then click next. In your wizard, then click next. Next, type in the IP address of the copier printer and click next. Select custom and then next. Select replace the existing driver and select next. Now you can name the printer or continue to use the default name and then click next. Select do not share this printer and click next. Now finally, click Finish. Now that we've clicked Finish, the print driver has been installed. If we go to our list of printers, you'll notice the print driver is listed. And next we want to click Properties, right mouse click, click Properties. Now finally, the last step in the process is to tell the print driver what accessories we have attached to our copier printer. So we're going to select the Configuration tab, select Two-Way Communication, and we're going to type in the IP address of the copier printer. With the IP address typed in, select Update, and automatically through Two-Way Communication, all of the installed options will be identified for your copier printer. 
Next, select Apply, and then OK. Now we've successfully installed print drivers for a Fiery print controller. To summarize the steps, first determine the IP address of your BizHub. Next, download the updated drivers from our website. Third, install the new print driver as a new printer. And then finally, make sure the print driver is configured with the appropriate accessories. Now that concludes our presentation on installing print drivers on the Conic Benalta BizHub product line. Thank you.